You take the fucking can of tomatoes, right? And you fucking open it. And you crush them up with your fucking bare hands. Get in there and fucking do it. And it's like a piece of fucking paper right there. And you know how you do that? With a fucking knife. That's right, this fucking knife right here. Fucking do it. And then you cut yourself up a half an onion. Give it a rough fucking shock. And you fucking get yourself some fresh fucking basil. What kind of sausage, my friend? Well, it of course is fucking Italian sausage. Oh, you know that they ain't cooked all the way through. But they're good enough. You just want the flavor on the fucking pan right there. That's the key. You get yourself some water. And don't forget to salt the fucking water. Use salt. And you put a nice good amount in there. Lots of fucking salt. Make it rain in that bitch. You get these guys, they're like, Oh, your water to taste like the fucking sea that it came from. And then they put like a little pinch of salt there like that. Stupid fuck. Do you know how much salt the ocean has in it? When your sausage is about fucking done, you take yourself one of these fucking cutting boards. And if it just came out of the dishwasher like mine fucking did, you pat it the fuck down. Right? And then you take that fucking paper towel and you don't throw it the fuck away. You put it right there. Just like fucking that. Because otherwise you're gonna be slipping, sliding, you cut your fucking hand off. Take your fucking sausage and put it right there. And you'll put it on your countertop because it's fucking granite tile and who gives a shit, right? You ain't paying for it, it ain't yours. You're renting the house. And you let them chill. Right, they look like little fucking exploded dicks. You're gonna take this fucking thing, this contraption, and you're gonna dump your fucking onions and your garlic right into that fucking thing. And what that's gonna do is it's gonna start deglazing that shit, right? You keep the heat on three. And you get a fucking wooden spoon or a silicone spatula with the red handle. Oh, it's the fucking red handle. Don't fucking get that cheap shit from fucking Walmart. What the hell is wrong with you? Right? Stir this shit up nice and well. Now, there's about 85,000 certified fucking chefs out there right now going, Oh my god, you put the garlic in and it's gonna be overpowered by the onions. And the onions are gonna overpower the garlic. And the garlic's gonna make the onions take blah, 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 blah. Shut the fuck up. Aren't you doing the fucking cooking here? No, you're watching the video because you want to cook it. Now, now that we've established that, you just let this shit sit here. All right. You let it sit. Let it go. Don't let it get too crazy, like I said. Three. Right there, fucking three. Fuck you, just three. Let it go, looks good, right? It's gonna be good. What the fuck is this? This right here, my fucking friend, is flavor. It's called Nor Homestyle Stock, and if Marco motherfucking Pierre White can use this shit, so can you. Tomatoes, tomatoes. Do they have to be Cento? Do they have to be San Marzano? Yes, you fucking moron, they do. While you hold your fucking camera and try to use a can opener, right, like a fucking moron that I am, I'll tell you something, okay? Get a bowl, fucking mixing bowl, make sure there ain't no fucking insect shit, and you dump it in. Look at them fucking tomatoes. Mash these the fuck up, will ya? Just, just do that. But be careful. You don't want them fucking seeds scoring all over the place. If you know what I mean. You keep that shit in the bedroom. Oh, fucking there you go. Crushed fucking tomatoes. Bam, done. You did it. Go back here. Check this out. 
Nice light simmer, nothing burns. Good. What you're gonna keep doing is make sure that they do absorb some of this color, which is good. You want them to do that. You also want them to get kind of soft. All right. Onions and shit have a lot of acid. You want to get that shit out of the fucking way before you start mixing all your ingredients together. Why? I don't know. Do I look like I went to culinary school for more than 11 days? Because the answer is no. Next, you take your fucking knife. Alright? And cut your fucking sausage. Alright? Cut them into nice slices like that. Okay? What about all that fucking shit? that's coming out of the sausage. Have you fucking thought about that? Have you fuck, would you look at that? Would you fucking look at that? Look at all that sauce, you keep it. Don't let it go anywhere. Scrape it back into the fucking pan. All right, here's our next move, all right? We are gonna get some wine. The wine should be something that you would like to drink. I like red wine. There you go, with the wine. Good amount. Let it get nice and boily. Scrape this shit off the bottom of the pan with your fucking spatula, okay? Yeah, back and forth. Get it all up. All right, you want you want to basically clean the fucking pan, all right? Okay. Am I really making this video? Jesus Christ! Now you take the sausage and you put it in. You distribute the onions and the sausage, okay? Get everything nice and well balanced. Number three. This fucking, this thing right here. You rip the fucking cover off of it while your phone is pointed at something completely unrelated. But because you're holding a phone with two fingers in your left hand, you feel like a goddamn moron because you didn't just go to and you pour the thing right in there like that. Now, you can help it along by sort of chopping at it, right? But mix it in a little bit, let it start dissolving. That's it. And then you take your fucking tomatoes. Take them fucking shit right there. Come back in. Fold this up nicely. Camera screen is still upside down, which means my video is probably going to be upside down. Right. Don't have to be perfect here, okay? You're going to freaking simmer this shit for like an hour and a half. All right. Look at the color we've got already. Alright, that's a good color. It's a good starting point. I want our sauce to be nice and dark. We don't want it to be r bright red. And I think, you know, the brown bits and the red wine really help to make sure that we're going to get that color. Now take half of your fucking basil. Alright, not all of it. About half of it. Sprinkle that in there, man. Like the fairy dust that it is. And just give it a quick little introduction. There you go. It's fucking in there. Jesus Christ. God, I've been really doing this for 18 fucking minutes. Holy shit. Alright. Oh, there you go. Now what you do is just... Leave it on simmering fucking speed. I don't think it's any... Crazy. You fucking put that on there. Alright. There you go.